Hello everyone, this is Dr. Sam and today we will study Popliteal Vein Doppler Ultrasound. The popliteal vein is found in the popliteal fossa, that is the region behind the knee. Here is a transverse view showing the popliteal vein. The vein is compressible and will collapse when we apply probe pressure, whereas the artery will be pulsatile and is not compressible. And this is a longitudinal view of the popliteal vein. Here is an image of popliteal vein with color Doppler. This is a case of popliteal vein thrombosis. There is a blood clot present in the lumen of the vein. We will be unable to compress the vein with the probe. It is more rounded and has increased diameter. Here is another image of popliteal vein thrombosis in a longitudinal view. The vein will be non-compressible and intraluminal material is present. In this image we can see partial occlusion of the vein due to thrombosis. Only this part of the vein has blood flow and no flow is seen over here. In this longitudinal view we can see the partial occlusion more clearly. Complete occlusion is seen in this image due to thrombosis. There is no Doppler signal found in this selected region of the popliteal vein. Here is a transverse view showing complete occlusion in popliteal vein. No Doppler signal is found. With the help of spectral Doppler, Flow in popliteal vein can be further evaluated by checking the response to augmentation, which is done by squeezing the cough distal to the site of scan. Normally, this response lasts for 3 to 4 seconds after which the flow returns to normal. But in the case of thrombosis, there is a poor response to augmentation. We can actually see reflux of flow here. The blood is going in the opposite direction. The flow is seen above the baseline, whereas it was below the baseline prior to augmentation. In chronic cases of thrombosis, specific appearances are found. The thrombus will be hyperechoic. The vessel diameter will also be decreased. A synechia is a hyperechoic fibrous membrane that is found in chronic post-thrombotic change. In some cases, venous collaterals may form and we can see that in this transverse view, collaterals are seen adjacent to the popliteal vein. Popliteal vein aneurysm is very rare. In this case, you will see a circumscribed dilation of popliteal vein. Here is another image of popliteal vein aneurysm. There is a circumscribed dilation in a specific part of the vein. Turbulent flow will be seen at the site of aneurysm. You will see mixing of colors in color Doppler. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe and stay tuned for more imaging videos.